welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur. For your own safety and the safety of others, please refrain from the portal will open in three, two, one. Excellent. Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material prevents the patient grid will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. Please place the weighted storage cube on the 1500 MW aperture science heavy duty super colliding super button. Perfect. Please move quickly to the chamber lock as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. You're doing very well. Please be advised that a noticeable case of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the aperture science material emancipation grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental fillings, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operation. Well done. Remember, the aperture science bring your daughter to work day is the perfect time to have her tested. Welcome to test chamber 4. You're doing quite well. Once again, excellent work. As part of our required test protocol, we will not monitor the next test chamber. You will be entirely on your own. Good luck. of a required test protocol, a previous statement suggesting that we would not monitor this chamber was an outright fabrication. Good job. As part of a required test protocol, we will stop enhancing the truth in three, two, one. to the left of the chamber can and has caused permanent disabilities such as vaporization. Please be careful. Warning devices are required on all mobile equipment. However, alarms and flashing hazard lights have been found to agitate the high energy pellet and have therefore been disabled for your safety.
please note that we have added a consequence for failure. Any contact with the chamber floor will result in an unsatisfactory mark on your official testing record, followed by death. Good luck. Very impressive. Please note that any appearance of danger is merely a device to enhance your testing experience. The Enrichment Center regrets to inform you that this next test is impossible. Make no attempt to solve it. Fantastic. You remain resolute and resourceful in an atmosphere of extreme pessimism. to understand how a portal affects forward momentum, or to be more precise, how it does not. test protocol, we are pleased to present an amusing fact. The device is now more valuable than the organs and combined incomes of everyone in Subject Phone Call here. Can you see there? Blame yourself. Blame into space. Feel free to pass out. An intubation associate will be dispatched to revive you with peptic salve and adrenaline. As part of the previously mentioned... Due to mandatory scheduled maintenance, the appropriate chamber for this testing sequence is currently unavailable. It has been replaced with a live fire course designed for military androids. The enrichment center apologizes for the inconvenience and wishes you the best of luck.
vital apparatus and will deliver a weighted companion cube in 3, 2, 1. This weighted companion cube will accompany you through the test chamber. Please take care of it. The symptoms most commonly produced by enrichment center testing are superstition, perceiving inanimate objects as alive, and hallucinations. The enrichment center reminds you that the weighted companion cube will never threaten to stab you and, in fact, cannot speak. You did it. The weighted companion cube certainly brought you good luck. However, it cannot accompany you for the rest of the test and, unfortunately, you euthanize your faithful companion cube more quickly than any test subject on record. Congratulations. Well done. Be advised that the next test requires exposure to uninsulated electrical parts that may be dangerous under certain conditions. For more information, please attend an enrichment center electrical safety seminar. Congratulations. The test is now over. All aperture technologies remain safely operational up to 4,000 degrees Kelvin. Best assured that there is absolutely no chance of a dangerous equipment malfunction prior to your victory incandescence. Thank you for participating in this aperture science computer-aided enrichment activity. Goodbye. What are you doing?
conditions. Was it worth it? Because despite your violent behavior, the only thing you've managed to break so far is my heart. Maybe you could settle for that and we'll just call it a day. I guess we both know that isn't going to happen. You chose this path. Now I have a surprise for you. Deploying surprise in five, four. Time out for a second. You're kidding me. Did you just set that aperture science thing we don't know what it does into an aperture science emergency intelligence incinerator? That has got to be the dumbest thing that- Whoa, 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 whoa. Good news. I figured out what that thing you just incinerated did. It was a morality core they installed after I flooded the enrichment center with a deadly neurotoxin to make me stop flooding the enrichment center with a deadly Toxin. So get comfortable while I warm up the neurotoxin emitters. Huh. The code may have had some ancillary responsibilities. I can't trust the internet defenses. If you want my advice, trust me. It'll be a lot less painful than the neurotoxin. Do you saw something burning? Well, <laughs> you think you're doing some damage? Dude, okay, I don't know if you can hear me, but I, I, I actually finally got world record. Holy shit. After, <laughs> I don't know, it's kind of embarrassing, of uh, like four hours and 45 minute grind on and off breaks, of course. Oh my god, dude. There's more to do. There's way more to do. But I keep fucking, like, certain things up and it's so annoying. But, but I, but I got it. I got, I got world record by five seconds. Probably four. Uh, it's margin error of one second. For the six seconds past world record, so. I did it. Now I probably may or may not have a video. That has gonna probably get like two like two views I don't know 200 I don't know but I got it finally dude that's unreal though I keep messing up record it was so annoying <laughs> but I finally got it which nice let me check glitch rules 1752 yep World record by five seconds, guys. Wow. Yeah, wow. So good. So good. I'm so good at the game. I fucking... I hate this game. Oh, my God. That's nice, though. GG to me, I guess, because no one fucking plays this category. Subcategory. For console. Yeah. Well, yeah, console. Like, no one plays console. 